Good morning, children. In today's math class, we'll see a new topic: addition. Okay. So we have seen about addition already. Yes or no, children? Yes. What is addition? It is a process of adding something or uh, to find the total of anything. So we are adding up. We are including the numbers. Okay. So all the numbers we are considering. That is addition. Okay. So see here. Recall. Just to recall, they have given seventy plus thirty-five. Okay. So how did I ask you to add on that day? Here you have two digits. Here also you have two two digits. Okay. So before that, write place values ones and tens. So ones and tens I have written. So always from where you will you start adding the numbers from. Ones place. Here, what do you have in ones place? Five. Okay. So uh, one place, ones place, and ones place should be added. So here in ones place you have zero. Zero plus five. Okay. So you have nothing in one hand. Now on the other hand you have five. What will be the total if you join both the hands together? The so total will be five. So ones place you have to write five. Okay. So in tens place, coming to tens place next. Here three, and here seven. If you are taking ones place, both the sides you have to take ones place. If you are taking tens place, both the sides you have to take tens place. Clear. So three and seven. Okay. So you are adding up. Keep seven in your mind and three in the finger. After seven, what will you get? After seven, it is eight, nine, ten. Okay. So right to the front. What is your answer, children? Hundred and five. What is your answer? Hundred and five. Coming to the next one. What is your? Uh, which is in one's place? Three. Three is in one's place, and here. Eight is in ones place. So eight plus three will be eight in the mind, three in the finger. After eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, okay. So now you have eleven. Two. It is a two-digit number. Yes or no? Yes. So the, there also you have to take ones place. Write it here and carry over this tens place in any of your tens place um digit. Okay, so see here one plus six plus two. Here you have two in tens place, six in tens place, and one more number you have carried over. That also you have to consider. Yes or no, children? To add, yes. So one plus six will be the next number of six will be seven. Okay, so six plus one will be seven. Six plus sorry, seven plus two will be two. Seven plus two, after seven, eight and nine. Okay, so what is your answer? Sixty-eight plus twenty-three equal to ninety-one. I'll tell you once again, children. See here, three is in one's place, eight is in one's place. While adding eight and three, you have eleven. So in that eleven, you have to write one alone here. One should be carried over to the tens place. Okay. So in tens place, what are the numbers? What are the digits you have? One, six, and two. Okay. So all these three you have to add. Okay. So one plus six will be seven. Seven plus uh, two will be nine. Okay. Next one, fifty-one plus thirty-seven. How will you add one's place here? Also one's place. One seven. One plus seven will be eight. Then in tens place five and three. Five plus three will be eight. So the answer is eighty-eight. This is just for recalling children. So now we'll get into the topic addition without re regrouping. What is without regrouping? Without carrying over the numbers. Okay. Addition of three-digit numbers without Regrouping. So, first example is given as add 
132 and 241. Okay. So, using abacus, first put 132 as. See here, your first abacus shows 132. Because in hundreds place you have 1 beats. In tens place you have 3 beats. And in ones place you have 2 beats. Okay. Then you are adding some more digits in the particular place values okay then add 241 as 2 more in 200 and 4 more in tens and 2 more in ones okay so now you look at the abacus 2 you are adding in hundreds place so already you have 1 and 2 more you are adding so it will be 3 and Already you have 3 in tens place. Now 4 more you are adding. So it will be 1, 2, 3 already. And now you have 4. So 4, 5, 6, 7. Totally 7 beats you have in tens place. And 2 more you are adding in ones place. Already you have 2 more. Now you are adding with 2 more. So it will be. Sorry. Here it is a printing mistake one more in ones so it will be already you have two and here one you are adding okay so totally three so answer of addition so the answer you are getting here is the sum of these numbers okay children so answer of addition of two or three numbers is called sum of the numbers the answer if you are getting for a subtraction of two numbers, it is said to be the difference. Okay, children. Okay. Shall we do the sum now? Okay. So, now you have 1, 6 and 2 in 1's place. 4 and 2 in 10's place. 4 and 3 in 100's place. Okay, children. Okay. So, now see here. Now, you have to add up all the 1's place separately, 10's place separately and 100's place separately. So, what are the digits you have in 1's place? 1, 6, 2. 1 plus 6 will be 7. Always the next number will be the addition of 1, uh, one with the other number. Okay. Uh, 6 plus 1. The next number is plus 1 is the next number. 7. 7 plus 2 will be 9. So, 4 plus 2 will be 4 in the mind, 2 in the finger. After 4, 5, 6. Then 4 plus 3. 4 in the mind, 3 in the finger. After 4, 5, 6, 7. So what is your answer? 769. Okay. So do these 3 as homework children. I will tell you how to do this alone. It is not given vertically. You have to. Just uh, you, uh, you have to keep your uh, numbers as it is and do it. Okay. So, ones place. What are ones place here? Here, 3. It is in ones place alone. Here, 2, 452 has 2 ones. 34 has 4 ones. Okay. So, first add up all the ones place right here. Add here you don't have any tens place. So, add tens place from uh, both the numbers. Then add and write to the front. Okay. Then in hundreds place you have only 4. So add uh, just write that number before that. Okay children. Okay. In next class we will see about the addition of 3 digit number with regrouping. Okay. Thank you.